wheelchair's frozen again. Finally got off the lake last night and uh, was super pumped, amped, excited, stoked, whatever you want to say. When I got off the lake just because the journey was over, and it feels good to have completed it. And it was an awesome trip on redfish and oh, had a lot of fun. But then after putting everything away and in the van, I just hit a real low. And I think what that is is just the exhaustion finally sets in. You get a little high after reaching, getting back to the van and realizing the journey's over and then hit a low when the exhaustion sets in. So anyways, I made it as far as the side of the road here, pulled over, slept, kind of slept. It's freezing cold. Um, I'd show you the dog's water bowl. It was frozen solid and it was in the van with me. Anyways, but I did get some sleep and I'm feeling better today and now I can reflect and really feel good about Redfish Lake and having stay on it for three nights in a canoe and 15 degrees weather. Um, Nora's happy too. And so now we just slept. See the mountains over there still. We're gonna head down the 75 towards Idaho Falls and find a hot springs and go soak and warm up and get rid of the stink, the stench. Man, you're happy. All right, see you later. So every now and then on the road, you get way ahead of budget or way behind the money and you have to figure out how you're gonna survive for three weeks. One good option is to go way up into the woods, park out in the middle of nowhere, and just use what you have somewhere where you can't spend any more of your money. Or you hang out in a Walmart parking lot, which is what I'm doing, and then I'm gonna go to the library later. I still have to figure out how I would like to take a shower. So Maybe I'll wait a few more days on the shower and there'll be some hot springs or a freezing cold creek up in the mountains where I could clean up. But yeah, the goal is to not spend any money for a few days as I head over towards the Flaming Gorge. Save my money because I got to get all the way down through Colorado to Lake Powell before the month's over. And I need gas and gas is kind of all over the place right now. It could be 450 tomorrow. I don't know. So... Nora can chase flies for her entertainment today. It's raining too. Always no fun to be on the road when it's raining. It's good for the van. The van needed a wash. I obviously don't need to spend any more money. I've got a million different things back here. So, Anyways, we're chilling in the van, waking up. Made some coffee, had some oatmeal. Nora's ready to go. Probably go for a few bike rides too. Good, cheap, free entertainment. Kill some time on the road, save a few bucks. See you next time. So, I ended up going for this cool spot just off of the highway. Highway's right over there. No places to spend money up here in the National Forest of Utah. The sun's finally coming back out. At least the blue skies are. Yeah, this will be a good spot to sleep for the night and then head over to the Flaming Gorge tomorrow. Get the boat ready to put on the water here in the next few days. Yeah. I finally made it to the Flaming Gorge. Where was I? Redfish Lake last. This was, I don't know, eight, ten hours. I think I spent a total of a week getting here. No. Wednesday till Monday or so. Anyways. Someone left a little bit of a... Uh, Sticks and burnt logs. I'm hoping I'm allowed to have a campfire up here. The Flaming Gorge starts right over there, so this creek is one of the tributaries. And yeah, I got the rock in there. I'm thinking I might be able to cook my $1 Walmart pizza over an open fire. We'll see. I also, I'm thinking that I might be able to use this stick right here to make the extra ama I need. You know, I only have the two up front. These two have gone flat on me and they're just horrible. So, 
I'm gonna hopefully get that stick or a better stick or a couple of those sticks, wrap them together and then wrap them with, uh, and what am I gonna wrap them with? Forgotten how to talk. I'm gonna wrap them with foam. Some EVA or some waterproof foam. And those should be pretty good. Maybe I'll put the boat on the water tomorrow. Maybe I'll just work on things so that I can put the boat on the water Tuesday. It's supposed to be freezing cold on the water come Wednesday, so I might just wait until after that. I don't know. I just did 16 degrees weather up in Redfish. You know that. So maybe I'll just go out in 31 degrees and it won't be that bad. I don't know. It sure feels good right now. It's awfully warm. I'm tired of sleeping up in the mountains where it's cold. Gonna get down into some of this high desert, low desert, I don't know what it is. Climate where it's warmer. Wish me luck on the pizza.